Hey guys, welcome back to Songs of Conquest. We're about to start mission four, Death Di Di Diplomacy. So let's see, Loth had brought on, brought an evil into the world and as a vassal of Stoutheart, it was Cecilia's responsibility to stop them. She reinforced the towns of Hazel Point and Oakhaven and headed north through the Tender Wild with the remainder of her forces. Hoping to draft troops from the settlements along the way, she was planning on attacking Grey Tor, Lost Capital, and the heart of their barony. Alright, let's get into it. Curious as to how the towns start off now. Uh, the threat of Loth. After a desperate race through the tender wild, Cecilia's troops finally neared the edge of the forest and the barony of Loth. She had levied some troops along the way, but far fewer than she had hoped for. It would have to be enough. Loth must be stopped. Okay, so we... We have level up. Okay. Uh, let's take magic resistance. Anything down this way? No, doesn't look like it. Okay, we'll go here. And just head down. We have two stacks or two sm small stacks of militia, footmen, and also knights. Interesting. No archers this time. Uh, let's take Glimmer Weave. Okay, visited. Perfect. Clear signs of corruption had spread through the woods. Cecilia could hear the chittering of rats and caught glimpses of undead soldiers shambling through the area. Okay. A thunder of plague rats, a thunder of rats, a roar of oathbound, and a command of spectres. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's let's just fight it. Don't have much other choice. Real question is going to be how we use our knights to maximize damage, I guess. 80, 69. Wow. Okay, that's a lot. Uh, let's go up here. 45, 15 to 46. They can reach us. Plague rats and normal rats. Okay, we need to all these guys down first. Uh, okay, let's pacify these rats. The spectres can reach us, so the rats and the spectres can reach us, nothing else can. Okay. Uh, let's go up on the high ground, I think. Uh, let's see. I will defend. Uh, we can get... The rats can't attack anyone other than the footmen. Okay, let's... Double stack them up. Ooh, I should not have done that. They got berserking. Yikes, that's going to be a lot of damage. That was a mistake. Okay. Can't do anything there. 17 to 52. Oh, 
high ground offense. Uh, how much damage are we going to do? One to three. So we've got seven. Seven. So that's 91 to 112. Base. 35. So that does 35 to... Okay. So I think we'll just sit tight. Uh, let's protect our knights too. So let's head in. Uh, 22 O of 2. Buff them up. Uh, yeah, let's hit the rats. Uh, let's take out these guys if we can. We will take out the rats. Okay. Two there. Uh, yeah. Let's just hit these guys. Okay. Let's do a rally. Can't do that. Okay. Uh, let's... Uh, now, yeah, we'll hit these guys. Let's go over here, over here, over here, and hit these guys. Uh, pacify. And it's them dead. Lost a lot of footmen. That was a bit of a rough one. As the last of the skeletons fell before Cecilia's dwindling troops, a massive figure strode from the dense underbrush. I thought you were an honourable warrior. Was I wrong to let you live the last time we met? No, Cecilia Star Stoutheart. It is because of my honour that I've come to offer safe passage through the remainder of the Tenderwald. Will you accept my escort? What do they call you? I am Nor, High Chief of the Fae and leader of the Queen's Guard. Well, Nor, you may walk with us, but know that my soldiers will be watching you. Okay, so I I guess once we find a town, Nor should be horrible as a wielder. I'm guessing. Uh, we want Ancient Amber. Friend or foe, Nor walked alongside Cecilia, his huge form looming over her. Our queen, Ethel Erneline, has long warned us of a great threat to the Fae. Many of my people think you are that threat, but I am uncertain. I have seen you fight the undead and the humans who raise them. I will destroy the undead and lost will pay for the corruption they brought into the world, but make no mistake, I will fight any Fae who break the ancient covenant. The deaths at Thorncliff will not be forgotten. It is your people who have pushed the boundaries deeper into the Tenderwald. We only sought to defend ourselves. I was not aware that our trespasses were so severe. Now you are. Okay. There's wooden idol over there. Okay. This map looks good really big so that's interesting the oath keeper Ooh, that is a nice item 900 gold wow that's a terrible offer for the oath keeper 
Okay, Fallen Beacon of Power. Treasure Chest level 2, level 1. Okay, so we have no choice but to move in here. Ooh, we have nine slots. Okay, interesting. So we don't, we, we have command at nine, but two, four, six, eight, nine. So we don't get the extra command from the item. That's interesting. Fey spirits flew towards Cecilia's line, but before they could attack, Nor stepped to the front and whistled three sharp notes. Easy, little friends. These are not foes. They fight the undead. Not foes? We follow and kill dead. Yes, Nor, yes. Stoutheart, I've heard your words, observed your actions. Your goal is the same as ours. Let us heal the breach between our people and face this corruption together. Okay, maybe we will get to use the... Ah, uh, Fey Truths. Now, are you offering an alliance? For in truth, I am in dire need of allies, even strange ones such as you. We are. These spirits will do your bidding, spirits. This wielder is your master now. Master, yes. Kill the dead. Yes, little spirits, we kill the dead. Good, good, good master. Yes, we want to bring them in. That's perfect. Uh, should probably have moved down there, I think. Okay, let's take the chest. Let's take the ancient amber. Okay. We haven't yet. Yeah, we're all okay. We haven't missed anything, so that's good. Okay, now let's attack these guys. Rank upon rank of undead legionnaires had risen in the clearing. The earth around them was corrupted, and the forest showed signs of decay. Bound by oath, bound to her. These undead have appeared in many places in the tender world. Ever since a human knight shattered the urn of Aurelia. And I thought you had created them. I apologize for my actions and those of my vassal Loth. Why would you do such a thing? We have forever kept a vigil to safeguard the world from the corruption of undeath. Bound by oath, bound to conquer. They are advancing form lines. Yes master, good lines. Form lines, death to dead. Okay, now how do we want to play this? I think we want the... We still want the footmen in front. The face spirits, though, we don't necessarily want them in front. Let's quick battle and see what we get. I think we'll lose quite a few. We lost eight. Let's see if we can improve on that. Uh, we will hold position. Okay. Oh, these guys are quite tough. They have defend, guard, and shield. These guys have guard and but not shield. Okay, shoot them then. Uh, let's see. We might want to... Base spirits. Knights. Uh, let's buff up this stack of face spirits. They will be in range of basically everything, okay? Uh, let's see. We want 
this stack to move first. Quicken, quicken. We don't want to shoot just yet, I don't think. Let's go up here. use blood boil we'll move all the way up there oh, blocked off by this thing here okay seven six to seven die Sure, let's not do that just yet. Uh, hang on, how many? 30. Okay, let's boost it a bit more. Ooh, they're still taking a lot of damage. Took way more than I would have liked. they will die we've already lost or yeah taken more damage than that than the quick battle so that's a bit unfortunate uh 22 let's go here uh, let's go up here Nice. Okay. Not great. Took more casualties than the quick battle, so that's unfortunate. Anything here? Nope. Just the glimmer weave grove. Okay. All right. Now, Fay of the Tender Wild. Maybe they'll join us too. Uh, let's see. Let's head over here first. save it, although this is a easy win, it seems. A gathering of horn ones charged into the clearing. As they reached for their clubs, Nor stepped in front of Sevilla, Cecilia and stamped his hoof, once in challenge and once in command. This is the wielder who bested your brethren, who bested me. Impressive for one so small. She's here to battle the undead, we shall fight beside her. The world will shake and their bones will break. The clans of the Horn Ones will fight. I regret the deception that caused me to raise my sword against your brethren. They were mighty warriors. We care little about the past. The moment is where we live and in this moment we shall fight beside you and not against you. Ten of these guys, that's pretty strong. I like it. Okay, let's see. Anything else here? No, we've basically hit everything else up. So let's keep moving forwards. Oh, are we gonna actually get the Fey Nobles as well? Three Fey Nobles appeared from nowhere. Nor issued a courtly bow and they raised an arm in greeting. You keep strange company, Nor High Chief. What did you discover? Was Giandra correct? And you've brought Stoutheart to face judgment? Stoutheart did not break the urn. Stoutheart fights the undead, and Giandra is blinded by her grief and her need for revenge. It may matter little. Weesh the Seneschal from long ago is risen. Those strange robed humans, the unseen society, scour old ruins for powerful artifacts. We can only guess their purpose. These are dark times, little human, and we see much uncertainty ahead. 
noble fae the future is always uncertain but know this i will defeat this undead wielder and hunt down these cultists who dig up the past if you will join us the outcome will surely be in our favor i understand why your line is called stoutheart the future is still clouded but we shall fight beside you okay yes join us thank you Okay, so we have to uh, beat Weesh. Okay, radio. Cecilia of Stoutheart, we have been sent to wait for you. You wear the colors of Loth, but hide your faces. Who are you? We, the Unseen Society, formally extend a hand of friendship. The Empress has observed you and deemed you worthy. Will you take the oath? I decline your offer. The Empress is dead and you will be too. That might be, but our oath will live on. Fey allies, it is time to make good our alliance and stop this cult from spreading like the corruption it is. Blood, death. Uh, okay. Who do we want on the high ground? Uh, I think we ooh, do we want to leave uh, do we want to leave the face spirits up here we could leave all of these up there because they are actually quite strong oh and they're fast so they can charge through uh, the knights can probably go here uh, does say simple, which is interesting. Let's do quick battle. See what this says. One knight and three face spirits. Ooh. Are these acceptable losses? I think so, yes. Let's just accept that. When the last of the cultists lay dead on the ground, a familiar one-antlered fey wielder emerged from the woods and picked her way across the battlefield. Giandra Stormspire had arrived. Nor, High Chief, you disobeyed my command and I find you in the company of our enemy, or have you brought her here for judgment? You would not listen to my counsel, Giandra. I had to show you the truth. Cecilia Stoutheart is not our enemy. Stormspire, you assumed I had broken the covenant by destroying this urn. Though it was by human hand, it was not by my order. If I recover it, it is too late. The urn contained the ashes of Empress Aurelia. We have protected it for centuries, and now the Unseen Society have used it to raise the Empress Aurelia from the dead. Our Queen warned us of this. Then let us turn our rage against the Empress Risen and save the tender wild you love. What say you? Can we find peace? It is what the Queen would want, Giandra. You are ever my good counsel, Nor, Cecilia of Stoutheart. We, Fae, offer an alliance on behalf of our Queen, Ethel Erneline, to fight against the Undead Empress and to renew the peace and respect between our people. I have seen the bravery of the Fae in the field of battle, and now I see the honour of your actions and the wisdom of your leadership. Stoutheart accepts. I would be glad to fight alongside you, Stormspire. Cecilia, if you build the homes of our people in these settlements, we shall come to your aid. Then let's rid this land of the filth that is undead. Oh, stonemason. Ah, uh, no, let's take magic resistance. Ah. Uh, I'm not sure we really need the... The... The, uh, stone. Or oh, stone generation. Okay, she has Cape of Leaves. Uh, that's not exactly what I wanted to do. Where's Cecilia? Okay. Alright, so... Gloves? Wait, hang on. Uh, Cecilia has Order Essence. Okay. 
speed of winds, troop movement. That's okay. I don't mind that. So he's got combat training. Nice. Melee, cunning, and scouting. What does Giandra have? Tune. She has command, cunning, chaos, channeling, and creation magic. That's not bad. I like that. Okay, so... Nor will Nor is obviously um, our offense, and he's specifically focused in melee. So let's see what we can do to improve that. Uh, ten offense. Uh, two, four, six, eight, nine. Yeah. Okay. So Cecilia is not benefiting from having Oathkeeper with the extra command. So let's give that to. Oh, do I want to give it to Nor, or would Giandra benefit more from the command because that will allow her to uh, that will allow her to generate essence better? That is a tough choice. Uh, Warhammer, sharp sword. Let's give Warhammer to Cecilia. Uh, 100 gold, that's fine. Two defense, one offense. I think give that to Nor. Cape of Leaves. 20% range resistance against the undead. Undead have some decent range troops. Seven defense, nine defense. Let's stack defense there, and we will... Yeah, that should be good. Four defense, four offense. Yeah, let's go with that. That should actually be much better. Gloves of the Wild Hunt. Gloves of the Wild Hunt, okay. Open face bassinet, yep. Nor can have that. Eight defense, Nor can have that too, I suppose. Seven, eight, Cape of Leaves, two Chaos Essence, two Order Essence, two Movement, two View Radius. Uh, I th yeah, I think we're going to just hang on to everything else the way they are. Uh, let's see. Giandra, okay, move down. War Spear is not very handy, so let's give that over. Uh, Giandra can also get these. War Defense, 20 range resistance. Uh, 7 defense. She is our caster, so let's give the... the Essence... Trinkets to Giandra. Now, what do we want to do about armies? Bay nobles. We can give these over. And we'll keep splitting them a bit. Uh, we can bring these guys over too. Uh, is this good enough? Or should we split more? Could split more. Or maybe not. Let's see. Chaos. Chaos times two. So let's split the the Fae Spirits. Fae Nobles give creation and chaos. Okay, so I think this should be fine for Giandra. Uh, now, we don't want Giandra splitting up her armies. So, here we'll do this and we'll split these guys up. We'll bring these guys over. 
and then we'll split them up too. Is this a good army for Nor? I'm not sure, but I think we should be okay. I'm happy with that. And then we can uh, just give the archers and footmen to Cecilia. Okay, I think that's the best way to move forward. Let's see what else we can pick up now. We need to get this town ASAP, so let's do that. Uh, bubbling pot visited, okay. Fay of the Tender Wild up here too. Maybe they will also join us. Uh, no, we don't want to do that. Aurelian Legionnaires. There's some wood over here. Giandra. Okay, let's end the turn. Uh, let's go with Cecilia. Briar's Bow. As the army neared Briar's Bow, a weary old footman came out to greet them. Wielder, it is, is it time to strike back? The Baron has gone mad and the Unseen Society is digging everywhere. They're unearthing old buildings and horrible skeleton soldiers. It's time. We're glad that you stand with us. This fight will be a long one. The Baron's men said it was for the greater good, but what's so good about bringing back the dead? It's not. It's evil. Simple as that. If you build a home for the Fae out of Briar's Bow, the Fae will, Fae will truly join the fight. It would be an honour to fight alongside the Fae. We're glad to have your support. Does the Barony of Loth control the rest of the area? No, many have joined them and are fiercely loyal, but just as many stand against this corruption. The great town of Stonebreach to the far north still resists and would welcome your aid as well as many smaller settlements nearby. Defeat Weesh, enlist the help of Stonebreach. Okay, this final mission is going to be a really long one. The map looks humongous. Which is uh, pretty okay for me as far as I'm concerned. So we have... We can upgrade, so let's do that. We... We do want the Fey Court. Uh, farm... Peasant hut. We need a barracks. And the barracks requires a lumber mill. Uh, let's see. So. Large farmhouse. Okay. Let's tag that up. We need that. Get this orchard. And we'll move along there. Uh, okay. The stone deposit looks like it's just uh, free. Cozy tavern, plus five movement. Is that enough? Yes, it is. Perfect. That was enough to get us in range. It's exactly what we wanted. Okay, this should be enough to... Let's go up here. The camp minstrels. Huh. Do we want minstrels? I guess for now we can take the minstrels. Five defense, five spell damage resistance. I guess we can take them. Uh, bubbling bog. Nice. Uh, insignificant. Okay. So... This should be an easy win. I'm actually hoping they'll join us, so let's see what happens. Well, never mind. Okay, let's end the turn. Alright, let's see. Save the game. Giandra, will they join us? The welcoming warmth of the tender wild drifted out and around the army. The alliance was mended. 
Yes, absolutely, we want them to join. That's exactly what I was hoping for. Giant mushrooms. Plus one damage. Uh, let's take the ancient amber. Okay. Let's see, will these guys join us? Yes, they will. Perfect. Love it. What? Come on. Okay, that was weird. Uh, more of the Fae of the Tender Wild. Can't see how many exactly though. But that's actually perfectly fine. So let's take that. Let's get that. Let's hit this thing up. Uh, let's get experience. Wood. Okay. Head up this way. Barony of Loth troops. Uh, let's save it here. I'm curious whether these guys will join me now. Yes, they will. Perfect. Nice, I love it. Bandit hiding. Ooh. Do we want to hit that yet? No, I don't think so. Well, since it's optional, I think we will head north to Stonebridge. See if we can uh, capture that town. Can we see it? No, we can't. Alright, never mind. I was actually kind of hoping that it would be... I was hoping we would be able to see if it's actually uh, a potential level tap level uh, five uh, town, which would have been really handy. Uh, okay, let's see. That's not ideal. Uh, okay, so we need to let's stack that together and then we'll buy these guys and there's some loth troops over there well fortified militia I don't know if those guys are going to attack us or not and there's some stuff down here that we could we could pick up and use which would be handy uh, let's see. We haven't visited that, so let's do that next turn. So far, I've liked the scaling of the missions. Uh, this, the art, this Arleon campaign is probably, I guess, the sort of tutorial that's led up to this particular mission where it's an actually f uh, full-blown proper mission where you have to do things as opposed to the first two missions being like uh, essentially tutorial missions and then the third one being an introduction to a larger map fair and then obviously this one is a is a proper map like you would play in a in a, one of the conquest maps or challenge maps so that's pretty interesting let's save it here and oh, we can't fight okay don't have the movement for it that's fine don't want to do that just yet uh, let's pick up some more of these guys yes Okay, Swamp Beast, Radio, Fay Grove, oh hell yes. I wonder if, is there somewhere to upgrade these? That's what I'm curious about. Okay, we need this over here. Glimmer Weave, yeah, let's take the Glimmer Weave. Okay, save it here and we'll pick these guys up too. Absolutely, we want to take them. 
Bay Court, Bay Grove. Stack of five. We don't have enough to pick them all up, unfortunately. Okay, that's fine. Jandra can't do anything just yet. Uh, all right. Yeah, not trained here. I don't know it, how to upgrade these if that's even possible. Okay, these guys will want to join me for sure, surely. Ancient Amber. Six to ten. Okay, yep, yeah, we can. Yeah, that's fine. Let's go. We've got full stack there now. Will this be done in one round? Okay. Let's see. Yes, yes it will be. Let's get the Fay Grove. Uh, requires a farm. Yep, so let's do that. We don't need to um, destroy this peasant hut just yet. We can focus on on uh, these the Fay buildings. Uh, what I need now is a lumber camp uh, let's save it here uh, i want to try and fight this let's see how we go uh okay that's interesting let's put these guys here like that and like that quick battle what's the damage here four and seven Oh, that is a lot of rats. Holy moly. Four and seven. Can I actually do better than this? I don't think so. I'll accept it. And yeah, let's just move in here to pick up all this stuff. Okay. Fallen Beacon of Power. Alright, what are these boots? Three movement, three initiative. Ooh, okay, very nice. Now, the question is, do I want them on Cecilia or do I want them on Giandra? That's the question. Okay, pick all this stuff up. And Queen Ethel Ernaline long mourned the passing of King Aerith Amelin, refusing to speak to anyone about his death. So deep was her sorrow that the mere mention of his name brought her to tears, and in that sorrow her reign began. Okay. Ah, uh, let's go over here then. Ah, uh, what are we doing now? We are picking up the rest of these guys. We are also taking the rest of these guys. We can probably pick these guys up. Yes, they want to join. Let's get them in. We will get the experience and let's claim the Glimmerweave Grove. Is there anything else? No, there's not. Uh, everything else is... Yeah, it looks like everything else is basically fine. To be picked up by Giandra next turn. We do want to come to the Scholar's Lectern with uh, Cecilia. And we are building. Alright, let's end the turn. And now I think we want to get Giandra leveled up. If we can, because we want it uh magic use. Uh, let's see. Okay. Uh three movement, three initiative. So let's give that to her. She uh Cecilia can 
reclaim those boots. Now we've got to figure out what we want to do with our army. We do not want the minstrels here. Uh, let's see. We'll take the, the nobles. We'll take these as well. Uh, okay, yeah, I think that's good enough. We'll get full stacks of everything. Except for the Fey Nobles. That can't help. Okay, so Cecilia's going to the Waterfall. Three movement. Essence Anomaly. Scholar's Lectern. And then come down here. Can Levitating Obelisk. Okay, let's see. Nor has some resources to pick up. Secluded Monastery is going to be nice depending on what we get from that. Oh, there's a dead commander over here. I missed that. Round shield? No thanks. We'll take the... We will take the cash. Waterfall? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Three movement is going to be handy. Uh, wooden idol? Source. Okay, only one. That's fine. Uh, ancient Amber. Bay Grove, we can't really do much about. Okay, so we can move through there. So let's do that. And let's end the turn. Now, if we can actually get them this oh we can upgrade this beautiful okay let's do that and now we will take what do we want to take take the barracks i think we have to take the barracks okay that's that's fine we need to unlock these guys and we can't upgrade need more glimmer weave okay that's fine all right, so now the new plan is we head all the way back down here to upgrade all our nobles to queens. This one's empty. We can't do anything there. So let's hit up the levitating obelisk can. giant mushroom and then there's a bubbling bog here okay blacksmith road sign cozy tavern ah we need to improve our command on both nor and giandra can we come down here? Or can we liberate everything down here? Liberate, so to speak. Ah, uh, yeah, let's end the turn. At the very least, we can investigate. Yeah, we can. It's simple, so let's do it. Ah, okay. How do we want to do this? Do we just do it like that? Oh, let's put these guys up there. Nothing was lost. Alright, perfect. Command. What's his command? Six, two, four, six, seven. Okay. I'm actually thinking maybe I should give the command uh, weapon to Giandra just so she can generate essence way better. Fighting brutes? Nope. Take the gold. Burnt building. Out of movement. Uh, let's see. Giandra. Giandra. 
uh, upgrade. Yep. Okay, we can only get that one stack. All right. Ah, uh, let's see. Two chaos, one creation. Two chaos. Fey rages. Right. So currently we are limited by our glimmer weave production. Let's see. Two creation, one chaos. Okay, so we have to come into here. Uh, let's put uh, these in here. You can upgrade the stack to two. What else can we upgrade? Nothing. Okay. That's fine. We haven't been able to upgrade these guys yet, so okay. Let's get rid of our face spirits. Uh, two creation, one chaos. Two chaos, one creation. So let's split these up. And... Yeah, I think that should be, that should be fine. These two Fey Nobles, we'll just hang on to them. And we should be okay. Question now is, do we want to go through here or through here? This looks like there might be a sort of a town in here, so maybe we should go up through there. Uh, orchard. Bubbling bog can get picked up by Cecilia. So let's do that, actually. Okay, perfect. So Cecilia is going to come through here. Get the bubbling bog up. And now we're going to take a look at what we can do here. Uh, Alright. We have a lot of fey spirits that would be really nice if we could get upgraded but we can't right now. We require Glimmer Weave. What uh, we could do is, let's take this stack out here and we will head over this way to, to tag up all of this stuff over here. I think that's a good idea. Let's do that. And I th think, let's, let's hit this up. And I think this is a good place to end the episode. We've made our way to Briar Bow, I think. Yeah, Briar's Bow. So we're just uh, picking everything up in the uh, local vicinity. And we're now going to look to push towards Stone Breach and and also push out to the west here to get the gold mine which is going to help a lot and we sorted out our armies uh, i like that we carried over all the artifacts so we managed to um, give some artifacts over to Giandra and nor and it's also good to finally be able to recruit uh, recruit the Fey, the Fey units now, especially now that we have the Fey Court upgraded, the Fey Queen should be quite powerful uh, in order to push all the way up through the map and up to Stonebridge. So, looking forward to the rest of, I guess what this is, is the uh, an actual map in the campaign with the first two being tutorials so we really get to sink our teeth into a, 
a proper playthrough now so that's good and uh, so I'm excited to see what else this uh, this map has in store so thanks a lot for joining me and I'll see you in the next one